MES Indian School, a trailblazer in the field of virtual education. MES Indian School has given a new dimension to the concept of virtual classrooms. Undaunted by the crisis posed by the pandemic COVID-19, MES continues to illumine young students with the light of knowledge by virtually transferring the classrooms to their homes. MES believes in teamwork and collaboration. It divides the task and multiplies the success. We conduct virtual meetings at different levels to confront the present scenario. Thus, during a frightening phase in the history of mankind, when the entire world has gone into a literal lockdown, MES Indian School continues to educate its students by conducting virtual classes. At this juncture, MES Indian School expresses its sincere gratitude to the Qatar government and extends its solidarity in fighting against the pandemic COVID-19. MES Indian School is all set to face this global adversity with a fortitude that comes through the indomitable spirit and willpower of its management, staff, students and parents and the ICD department. That is why we are picking E equal to V by L. So we can substitute here E equal to V by L. So this is V D is equal to E V to Y M L. One another equation. It is in terms of... I am teaching of physics for class 11 and 12. Now I am teaching them through virtual classes. Students are very comfortable and cooperative. We are sending all worksheets and notes through parent portal. An online exam is conducted for class 12 students. We are supporting the students in all the possible ways to make them understand the concepts. Our appreciation to the MES management and MES principal for conducting these online classes well in time. It goes without saying that the effort of the teachers and their hard work is having a great impact on the students. The only thing she misses is the uh, live classrooms, which is inevitable at this uh, moment. Motor nerves carry the information or the decision from the brain to the muscle involved. Clear? And these muscles are formed of muscle cells or muscle fibers, which you have learned in class 9. Right? In class 9, you have learned about muscle fibers. Students of now are actually born into the world of electronic gadgets. And most of them are quite happy to use electronic gadgets. So, virtual learning, learning techniques, which is using these electronic gadgets, is quite interesting for the students as well. The virtual learning techniques cannot replace a real classroom, but still, it is having so many benefits. As of now, we are experiencing that we can have a one-to-one -one interaction with the students through the virtual classroom as well. There are many tools which we can use, like share screen, through which we can give clear-cut ideas about the objectives, what we want to teach. So the share screen can provide the PowerPoints. Through the share screen, we can provide PowerPoints, presentation, videos, everything related to the content. And moreover, this virtual learning is making our students self-learners. They can listen to the teachers, collect information from the portal and then make their own notes as well. Along with these classes, we are supporting the students with our e-learning portal, which is not new to MES. We used to upload all the supportive resources in the portals, which the students can access. There are videos also related to the concept, which is available for the students, which they can access from home also. So in all together, we are having a very good learning experience. Only thing missing is a physical presence of the student and teachers together in a classroom. But now for the current situation, virtual classes supporting the students like anything and also helping teachers to develop their technical skills as well. So being safe at home, the students can learn at their own pace with the study materials and listening and interacting with the teachers. Crisis COVID-19, which has transformed 
face to face interactive classroom learning into an online virtual class which clearly states that the best app which can be provided is the teacher the teachers and students are exposed to the exploration as they have adapted themselves to this crisis it is the first time in the history that the interactive classroom has entirely shifted into a virtual classroom the approach of the students and parents towards this virtual classroom learning is very friendly and positive as they adapt themselves to this particular crisis mes indian school has been a trend setter in the field of digital learning the school was the first expatriate school to introduce e-learning in 2011 the highly advanced e-learning portal of the school is augmented to ensure that the students can access any information at the flick of a click and handling the portal has never been difficult for the teachers and students as the school has made good use of the e-learning portal for a decade in the present scenario when regular schooling is impossible the e-learning portal is a paramount source of communication between teachers and students well in junior section we have implemented virtual classrooms in a new dimension by breaking all the barriers that hinder to eliminate the young minds in fact we understood that challenges always pave way to new possibilities to fulfill the objectives of virtual learning mes junior section has crossed all the limitations practically with the group of vibrant proactive and dynamic teachers we have also made a flexible schedule for class 3 and 4 in the afternoon wherein students have to attend only one subject per day which avoids the ill effects of tedious screen time i would like to start with a small quote you are allowed to scream you are allowed to cry but you are not allowed to give up yes that's what at mes we all have pledged to do in spite of all tough times and everyone is trying to fight against ongoing covid-19 pandemic we all have the will power to send through we are not leaving any stone unturned to ensure that each and every student of our school is not losing on their academic we are uploading worksheet assignment on weekly basis to ensure our students are maintaining pace of studies we are regularly interacting with students and parents and help to address each and every query and concern mes introduces the virtual classes for the senior students in morning hours and for the junior students in the afternoon hours and kindergarten in the early evening structure and routine tasks when done the right way for the right amount of time can bring a huge sense of security to the child this is the intent and inspiration behind mes kindergarten remote learning plan twice a week we have meet and greet sessions that is the virtual classes also we upload worksheets recorded rhymes and stories on a regular basis on the e-learning portal the overwhelming response from parents and students is a motivation for us to give our best each class would begin by checking the attendance of the students and ensuring the presence of all students frequent virtual meetings are held amongst the principal vice principals and heads of sections heads of departments and teachers to ensure the quality of the education imparted in this present situation as parents we are very glad that our children are being provided with various educational materials through e-learning we are very grateful to mea school management and teachers for taking this initiative to impart knowledge through virtual learning for our children thank you so much for your support facing a global catastrophe with a resolute and undeterred spirit with faith and determination is the need of the hour 
MEA's Indian school has always been at the helm when it comes to pioneering new and enigmatic projects. Virtual teachings which equals regular schooling is the latest in the list says the principal Mrs. Hamida Kadar, who believes that every dark clouds comes with a silver lining and every challenge hides within it new and splendid opportunities. Dear children, we miss your smiles. We miss the energy that you bring into the classroom. In this crisis that we are facing together, let us hope he will remain safe and healthy at home. I urge my children to follow all the guidelines given by Ministry of Health and Government of Qatar. I would like to thank the Government of Qatar, Embassy of India, our management, our beloved parents, my dear children, and our dedicated team of teachers who have foreseen this crisis and taken action accordingly. Hoping to see you all back in school with full energy and vitality. Wish you all the best. Thank you very much.